Uh, Shane, is it back to a referendum? Because I mean, we have, the question was put to the people and they said, mm. no, we don't want to give you politicians more powers here. So it doesn't mean we're stuck with the expensive lawyers and long years of investigations into anything we want to find out about. The investigations on the whole have been a failure. I think there's no doubt about that. They haven't achieved what they expected to achieve. And I think they've turned out to be vehicles for politicians rather than anything else. I mean, look at the banking inquiry. Why was that really set up? The banking inquiry was set up not to find out what happened. It was set up so that, so that Fianna Fáil would be put in the dock by the present coalition coming up to the general election. It was being ruthlessly exploited by one party for another. Now, of course, it's caught on the whole Abby Lara stuff, and it's going to, it's going to come out with a, a pretty flaccid report if it comes out with a report at all. It's run into the ground. Uh, look, at, look at the other... It, a lot of the other inquiries are just used... A lot of the planning inquiries, some of the commissions, are just used by the government and the IBRC inquiry. Are just so are they the toothless, the expensive tigers? Yes, I do, to a large extent. I think they're toothless tigers. I think that's what happens. But what I'm trying to say is this. They're used by the government as for kicking down the road problems which they don't want to address themselves. The IBRC is very convenient. It's going to come way after the general okay. election. <clears throat> so